Hello, hello, welcome back. Fortunately, I have some uh, another information here as uh, today comes along off and on. This okay, everybody knows what PFI is it's a cowboy boots and western wear outfits places. Well, this outfit here it's a hoodie and it's sold by PFI. It is uh, being dress code here in this lovely hometown of mine here. My son has been dress code not once but a couple times already. And I don't see anything wrong with this. Because it, it's, it's PFI. It's a boot store. Uh, I just don't understand what is the big deal about it. Does it, does anybody, I mean, does this spend anybody? I, you know, I mean, it's a boot store. You know, it, it's got all this diff nice stuff in it. Let's go ahead and go look at this store. See, this is the company that sells it. And it's just crazy. Very, very, very crazy. See, I did have another picture. Let's see if I can find this picture real quick, quick here. Slide this over here. And open that up. Okay. This is where it's at. See? This hoodie is in there. And it's PFI. What is the big deal about it? It should not be code violation. So, I mean, I don't see nothing wrong with it. It is a company. A very portable company that if they knew, probably, if people could start complaining about it, that their t-shirts or outfits are defending some places. I mean, it's I, I'd laugh at them. To me, I mean, because there's nothing wrong with it. And there really, really is not. And then, I don't know if I should put this up there, but. Let's see if I can do some editing here. And if they don't like it, well, they can kiss my butt. But I have some information that these names are here of these students are wanting to beat up my son. I don't take that kindly. I do not. That That's... So, probably sooner or later I'm going to talk to the police department and uh, see if we can get this figured out here because this bullying stuff here in my little hometown needs to get under control. A lot of this town's not going to like me if nothing's get done because... I'm going to be recording a lot of things and talking about this town. And this is just ridiculous how they're treating my son. But make sure you read these names right here really good. Because these people are supposed to be hurting my son. And uh, the I talked to the principal today. And uh, she got kind of defensive a little bit. Uh, saying, oh, he needs to get to school, he needs to get to school. But he tells me he does not feel safe going to school because of this issue going on. And that is just ridiculous. And then, let's see if I can do something else here real quickly. There is another thing, if I can get it to show right without doing very much of anything. And let's see. Uh. 
see if I can. There's one. Cause I don't want to show the name of the person that I got it from. Let's see. Copy open. Do, 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 do. Let's see if we can do that. Then go down to uh, Notepad. Like this over here for now. But I mean, this is getting ridic dick ridiculous on this stuff at the school here. I mean, it's just unbelievable. What, what's going on, you know? Hi, right, this is what it says. The people that are spreading, they're going to jump your son. Saying that they're going to jump my son. So, the names that I showed you guys, that's, I got this information from a very good source. And she's even having problems with this school system. That, uh, I mean, we really need to do something with the school system here and get this bullying and harassment thing figured out because, uh, my son does not feel safe going to school. So, why am I going to send him to the school if he does not feel safe in school? I mean, that is just ridiculous. And the kid who beat him up, this is not his first time doing it. Uh, let's see if I can read some of the information here. If I was... Da -da -da -da. Uh, let's see. This boy has been suspended several times and in trouble for the same stuff he's done to your boy. He, his parents are teachers, but anyways, if my, if it was my child, I would file charges on him for bullying and also with a mobile device that a federal. So that is getting ready to look into some charges for the kid and for anybody else that wants to uh, beat up my kid and then I will have to uh, see if we can figure out a way to uh, I guess uh, get somebody down from school board or something to uh, watch the school a little bit more carefully and figure out what is going on and what kind of teachers to uh, get out of the school system because I mean they shouldn't have no favoritism in the school because I know they did here in town. Because I, every time I turned around, I was getting yelled at. And now, I'm not really getting yelled at that much. Because the police officer that was a police officer is now a sheriff. And he told me that they was picking on people and harassing people. And I was the one that they was harassing. So, this town is very interesting, as you might say. But uh, thank you guys for watching my channel. And hopefully, you guys can help me get this situation under control and more of this information around the area because I need some help trying to get this uh, situated and uh, we don't need no bullying in school. The schools are supposed to be safe places for kids. That's, uh, you know, it's sad that there's not no places any safe anymore. Definitely going to school and getting beat up and something stupid like this, but... Uh, Thank you guys for watching my channel, and I will uh, talk to you all later. Hopefully, uh, tomorrow will be a better day, and we will see what happens tomorrow. Thank you all. Have a good day.